Well, hello and welcome to this uh, series of videos on how to in Spotfire. The question today is how can I handle filter schemes and what it means to have a filter scheme. So for this, I will quickly click create a dashboard. I'm going to have a bar chart, a scatter plot, and a pie, and I'm going to arrange them, the visualizations to be this way. And as you can see quickly, every time that I select something or unselect something from the filter panel, the data is changing automatically. Our scenario will be that we're going to have exactly the same dashboard here, and we're going to call this page manager A, and we're going to call this page manager B. Okay? So what we're going to do is notice how every time that I change something in the filter panel in one of the pages of the dashboard, the same change is going to happen in all other pages in the dashboard. You can see here exactly the same areas that here. Okay? So what is the scenario? The scenario is what if I have different major managers that are focused in a specific set of areas, but they are different. I want this manager to be able to have its own filter settings, and I want this manager to be able to have a completely different filter settings, okay? So for this, we're going to go to Edit, Document Properties, and you're going to go to the fourth tab, the one that says Filter Schemes. Here, you're going to check this box, and you're going to create two different filter schemes. One is going to be Manager A, and the second one is going to be Manager B. Okay? So what you're going to do now is that in Manager A, you are going to work under the Manager A filter scheme, meaning everything that you do here, it's going to remain under the Manager A filter scheme. So I will remove some of the areas, and whatever I do here is not going to go across all the other pages. So in Manager B page, I will call my Manager B filter scheme, and I will focus my information in a different group of data. Okay, so now I have a different group of data here that I'm focusing my information. Everything here is changing accordingly to my Manager B settings, and my Manager A settings are completely different and I can have a completely different uh, set of uh, settings for the filters per the different pages that you have in your dashboard, okay? That's how you can use a filter scheme, and it is actually very useful because you can have different users accessing the same data and the same data sources, but the dashboards are displaying different information depending on who is looking at the information, okay? So um, I hope this is helpful and that it answered the question. See you next time.